Valteren is part of the enormous Three Valleys, and the resort is one of superlatives. Valteren is the highest ski resort in Western Europe and has the longest season. Although it has fewer pistes and lifts than Korshvela Mirabel, there is more terrain in this area, and with a glacier and four peaks over 3,000 meters, snow is guaranteed. The resort is ski in, ski out, and wherever you're staying, you can ski to the lifts. The main hub of the resort is at the base of a three-sided bowl, and from here the Plansud, Peklet, Dulac and Caron lifts climb in different directions to the four main areas of the Valteren ski area. Beginners will stay at the base of the bowl. The four green runs that are on offer in Valteren are all grouped together here and are serviced by the Dulac chairlift and the four covered travelators. Once you're ready to branch out, it's probably best to head up the Plan Sud chairlift to the side of the valley that connects to Meribel. From here you can head down to Leminwier and Saint Martin de Belleville, which are a little more sheltered and have a better selection of easy blues. It's worth making a trip up the Plansud even if you don't want to ski, as you can stop off at the Folle Douce restaurant, one of the best apres ski spots on the hill. Make sure that if you are heading down to Limon Weir in Saint Martin that you have a lift ticket that will bring you back to Val Turenne. There are three lift ticket options open to you in Val Turenne. The simplest is the Val Turenne Pass that lets you ski in Val Turenne and Orel. For a bigger area, the Valteren Belleville Pass grants access to 300 kilometers of pistes in Valteren, Leminwier, Saint Martin, and Orel. Finally, the full Three Valleys Pass will give you the opportunity to ski in one of the world's largest connected ski areas, including the resorts of Meribel and Courchevel. There are blue pistes in Valteren, but they have sections that those who are fresh off the nursery slope might find quite scary. One of the easiest blues is the Jontaine piste, which is accessed via the Caron bubble. It's ideal for those looking to find their snow legs, as it's wide and open and gentle. If you're a little more confident on your edges, then the Moraine and Genepe piece that run under the Moraine chairlift are long and fast, and the Tête de Ronde that runs from the top of the Peclet is another popular piece for intermediates. Valteren is a great place for those who like steep, challenging pistes. Most of the runs here are red, and the best collection of them is on the southern slopes under the Seamed Caron, Grand Fawn and Portet. You can climb to this sector using either the Dulac or Moutier chairlift. Over the back of this area is the secret fourth valley in the Three Valleys, Orel. Regardless of which lift pass you've bought, you'll be able to ski in this area, and at the beginning of the week it's usually quiet as most tourists don't find it until later on. Do be aware though that the season in Orel is not as long as in Val Turen, so if you're here very early or late, the area might not be open. You can drop into Orel from either the top of the Grand Fawn chairlift or the Seam Caron. It's definitely easier to take the first option, as the piece from the top of Seam Caron is steep and very bumpy. For a gentler, easier route, take the blue run along the ridge and onto the Jontaine piste. There's only one black piste in Val Turenne, the Combe de Caron. For expert skiers, the best bet is to head off piste, where the terrain options are almost limitless. To stay safe and make the most of this, we'd recommend hiring a guide. Val Turenne's greatest asset is also sometimes a curse. Because it's so high, the snow here stays cold and fresh for ages, but the altitude means that there are no trees, so in bad weather visibility drops to almost zero and high winds can make it difficult and uncomfortable. On bad weather days avoid going too high, and if possible drop down to Saint Martin de Belleville or ski over in Meribel where the trees will offer shelter. When the weather is good though, it is worth making the trip to the very top of the hill. Avoid the top of the cold chairlift in the Glacier Torrent, as there's very little here and the cold piece can be very steep and icy. Instead, head over to the top of the Peclet bubble and onto the Peclet Glacier. Here there's a good restaurant and excellent views. Alternatively, head up the Seam Caron bubble which has a great viewpoint and spectacular panoramics. 
The skiing options in Val Turenne and lower down in Belleville are vast and when you add Meribel and Courchevel you have one of the largest ski areas in the world. On a bad weather day Val Turenne is the worst of the three resorts as there's almost no shelter from the elements. But when the sun is shining Val Turenne is excellent. The snow is always guaranteed in Val Turenne and it's possible to ski it for a full month longer than anywhere else in the three valleys.